Hello children. When we say or when we speak a sentence or when we write a sentence, we use lot of words. All these words are nothing but they are the English from the English grammar. They are the part of part of speech. Let's start with the part of speech and their types. This is the foundation of English grammar. Foundation and of English grammar is nothing but it will start with English part of speech. English part of speech are eight types. Starting from the first one that is noun. Noun is what? Noun is name of a person, place or thing. The examples it can be singular, plural or collective. We are not going to this part. Only I will say how you will find out what is noun. See, noun, how will you identify which is noun? When we see or touch or feel, we can see the noun. As we know, noun is the name of anything. Noun is what chair, for example, table, pen. They have their own share and we have given the name of that particular things that is chair, table, pen. So we can see that is noun. We can touch, touch the thing or person, pen, pencil, eraser. Or we can feel. Feel is what? The emotions which we can't see or touch. That is illness, friendship, ha happiness, etc. Now let's take an example. Here is a sentence. Sentence is Rina is a good girl. Here you can see Rina is what? It's noun. It's a name of a girl. See, this is noun. The composition of the word is makes a sentence which is having a meaning. See, it is is a good girl. They are the different part of part of speech. Is is what? Verb. A is what? Article. Good is what? It's a quality. That is why it is adjective. Girl is what? It's a noun. Let's start with the second part of the type. That is pronoun. Pronoun was? Pronoun is what? I will just write it down. When I say pronoun, pro plus noun, how you will find? Elaborate. When we replace noun, that is pronoun. Here I have taken one sentence that is Rina is a good, is a girl. Rina is a student. These two sentences are using the same name, Rina and Rina. These two sentences, instead of two, two words, this Rina, I am using some different word. She is a student. Rina is a girl and she is a student. This she is replacing Rina. That is why she is pronoun. We can take take some other example also he she it they i we and we and etc see the third point is third type is verb when we say verb verb is nothing but it is an action word action word when jab hum bolte hain action word is what Something we are doing, doing verb, doing, like, run, dance, play, sleep, okay, see, or we can remember like that, what is that, in Hindi also we say, khana, Sona, Parna, Jana, all this na, that means no. When you are remembering the no, that is always the action word. Work, play, see and eat. We will take an example here, one sentence. I eat my breakfast. You sleep early today. Here the action word is sleep and eat. Doing something. 
I'll eat my breakfast. You sleep my sleep early today. So these are these action words are identify verb. Now next is adverb. When I say adverb, adverb is what? A D ad plus verb. Adverb is what? When I am saying adverb, here you can take that this example. Sohan runs slowly. Sohan runs is a verb. It's emphasize slowly. Verb ko jo achhi tarah se batate, uske baare mein information deta hai. Verb ke baare mein tab wo adjective ho jata hai. You can change like this. Sohan runs fast. Sohan runs hurriedly. You can use so many words after the verb to elaborate adverb. There's a spelling mistake here. That is hurriedly. You have to just write properly. H u r r i e d l y. Hurriedly. Hurriedly. That means jaldi jaldi. Okay. Next is adjective. When I am saying about adjective, adjective, it's always saying something about the noun. What is their noun? Noun is Ram. Ram is a good boy. Here, Ra Ram is a honest boy. Here, honest is the quality. Yes. Next part is adjective. Here, I have written one sentence. Ram is an honest boy. Here, why it is an? You can see. And is because honest is sounding like a vowel, so that is why after age, before age, it has written an. Ram is what? Ram is the noun. It is saying the quality of Ram, honest. So when we are telling about good or bad, something about the thing or person, it is always adjective. See adjectives describing noun, black. Good, bad, beautiful, ugly. These are the examples. For, examples of adjective. Next is preposition. The name is identified preposition. When we are saying about preposition, preposition is nothing but the position, the location, the relationship. It is called preposition. Here you can see in, on, under, and above. Showing relationship or position. I have taken one sentence here. The book is on the table. Showing the position of the book. Book kaha par hai? It is showing the position location. That is on on the table. That is preposition. Then next is conjunction. When we are saying again conjunction, how will you remember? Connect the junction. You can remember conjunction. Join the words or sentences. Examples are and, or, but, and because. But how will you conjunction? How will you? How will it work? We I have taken two words. See, Sita and Gita. These are the two girls which are joining in one sentence with and. Sita and Gita are dancing. The next is I have used two sentences, which is joining with one word. I will go to school tomorrow, and I will finish my work. There are two sentences which are joining with the word word and. And the last is interjection. When we are saying about interjection, you can remember in our mobile we always use so many emojis, some moods, some emotions. So emotions, wow, hurrah, and out. See, there is one sign here, one straight line and one dot. With the with this sign is called the exclamatory sign. In this exclamatory sign, you can express the emotion. I have taken one sentence here, hurrah, India on the match. India match jit gaya hai usse khush hoke jo express kar raha hai that is hurra it is an emotion hurra India won the match so thank you.